So, originally, I was going to say that this mod was almost as good as Mario's Madness, then I played it. Then I changed my perspective to, it's better than Mario's Madness. So, this mod is called FNF Classified. It's basically based around the whole, every copy of Mario 64 is personalised. Now, the reason why at the current moment this is better than Mario's Madness mainly has to do with the fact that Mario's Madness V2 obviously isn't released. First, I want to go over the menus. The menus are clickable, which I love clickable menus, I gotta say. They're always well made. I like the title card with the Mario head from Mario 64. Anyway, now we're gonna move on to the songs and what I thought of them. So, the first song in the mod is called Watery Grave. It's obviously based around the Luigi creepypasta, probably something to do with Luigi drowning because he's stuck on a star or something like that, I don't know. But, first of all, I've got to say, I absolutely love the VHS overlay over it, over everything. Luigi's sprites are excellent, the chromatic work is well done, and the music. As well as, oh god, don't get me started on the transition halfway through, where it goes from normal to underwater when Luigi shouts Mario. And there's bubbles coming from the bottom of the screen. But anyway, first song in is already amazing. The second song of the mod, Funhouse, is based off, war off the Wario apparition from Mario 64. But this time, instead of being styled in a Super Mario 64 style, it's animated with Wario's head floating in the background and BF running. Now, I'm not really that much of a fan of the song. It's a good song, but not really in my taste. But anyway, moving on to the next song. The third song of the mod, called Your Copy, is based off of the Piracy Mario for Mario 64. It's a six, six and a half minute song, astonishingly. About four minutes of the song, you're playing against a twisted and mangled version of Mario. Around the two minute mark before the song is about to end, it switch, switches around to a Mario 64 style, which is really cool. I'll show you that now. Alright, fourth up we have Shrouded, which is a song based off that kinda goofy Mario EXE picture that almost all YouTubers use. You know the one, I'll show it up on screen now if I can find it. But it, yeah, this song is extremely good. I like how, Mar how the Mario in it glitches about, which causes the notes to change colour mid-song. It can be quite hard with some of his, his poses, with, because he has white hands, the notes blend into the hands and it can get quite difficult at times. But anyway, yeah, here's a little bit of footage for that. The fifth song in the mod is based off of like the MLG cartoony era of Mario, where he was in lots of memes and things like that. Now, this song doesn't really appeal to me because I, I don't really like it, to be honest. I like the gimmick where it goes like all multicolored all good old MLG style towards the end. Uh, I'll show you that on screen now. If you if you suffer from epilepsy, uh, please don't watch this part. And last but not least, the song that really sold me on the mod. The final song, where you face what seems to be a glitched out version of Mario that looks similar to GB from Mario's Madness. And the reason this really sold it for me is the gimmick of the mod. It does one of those things where it messes with your screen. Now, I don't know if I'll be able to record it because of the screen gimmick, but I'll see if I can. If I, if I can't record it on OBS, I'll record my uh, PC screen so you can still see it anyway. But this song is amazing, so enjoy it. And that concludes what, at the moment, is the best Mario horror mod at the moment. This beats Mario's Madness as of Mario's Madness V1. 
We all probably know that V2 will blow this out the water, but for what they've done for a six song mod is absolutely astonishing. I can't commend them enough. All I hope is that they haven't put like a virus on my PC with that six song. Probably not, but uh, yeah. The mod will be linked down below. I highly recommend you play it and leave as much support for the devs on it as possible. But with that said, I would appreciate it if you liked and subscribed. You don't have to, but I would really appreciate it if you did. But with that said, I'll see you all in the next video. Astronomical, out.